it seems to me there's much more evidence of a consensus that terrorism is uh, criminal, it's not war, and it's best dealt with as a crime. And all crimes, including the most horrific, are best dealt with by fair and decent traditional means. Uh, each country will have its own and the traditions will evolve. In this country, for serious offences under Commonwealth law, uh, which is terrorism, uh, that means trial by jury. Uh, that means evidence that is tested and that means fair and proper investigation. Uh, all of that, it seems to me, is a very important blow against uh, the evils that uh, terrorism uh, has this pretentious ambition to visit upon all of us. Pretentious because uh, there is no possibility of success in world domination by terrorists. Uh, but it is an ambition that leads to horrific acts and it's best dealt with by, as crime by ordinary process. I'm going to go back to our questioner. I, I know from reading your uh, question that you're actually a lawyer. Um, are you concerned by what you've seen? Is that the, the heart of your question? I am, and, um, and I'm experienced in constitutional law, and it seems to me, I mean, without giving a, a comment, Tony, because I, I know you uh, enjoy the comments, but uh, I, I guess it's more a question which is, um, it's, I, I've always wanted to have an example explained to me by, with Parliament, they often tell us that we need these new types of laws, and I'd like it explained to me what kind of crime could have been committed post-911 that we can't deal with with the existing laws that we had pre-911? I think the short answer is uh, the conspiracy offences would capture many, maybe nearly all, of those that are now on the books. There is a sliver, maybe bigger than a sliver, of very preliminary conduct, which in this country now uh, represent very serious offences for which you can be sent to jail for a very long time, as some people have been. That's my answer. Those have been added, but I have to say, I'm not quite sure whether they needed to be. Our pre-existing laws addressed uh, most of the evils.